All right, guys, this is Stephen Gogui, technical analyst of Allies Blue. So in this video, I'll discuss about Bank Nifty. Now you can see this is a Bank Nifty and a daily chart. Now let me explain uh, candlestick behavior uh, last few days, how candlestick are behaving, uh, how to read the candlestick properly. All right. So here we have seen in this candle, so first we have seen price just open in this area all right and whole day we have seen seller was dominating in this area and price push the lower up to this area again and seller uh, failed to continue to a downside and bugger, uh, sorry buyer are uh, enter here again price push up to our same area where uh, price was opened. So here you can see after that they are forming a doji bar. So most of the people are telling like a hammer pattern or whatever. So next day we have seen price exactly open in the same place previous uh, closing day and price a little more push up higher. Again uh, seller dominated and price pushed toward downside. Again price just push up toward same place and they are creating another pin bar here all right so that means in this uh, in this day we have seen buyer our seller are almost the same all right so next day you can see uh here price just open here price a little more push to our downside but fail and price again push up and close uh, above the opening all right so we have seen a bullish candle all right Next day we have seen buyer are here and at that time seller are dominating in this area again you can see buyer was dominating in this area so uh, after all when market closed buyer are seller was same when uh, forming this type of candle most of the professional traders never trade uh, next day why because they are observing today candle right how today candle are forming all right so suppose so let me tell you suppose uh, today candle form like bearish candle like that so in that case uh, most of the people are start selling below this area right so if they are forming a bullish candle here so they are looking for buy again right for the long term position now let me show you uh, intraday trader can i enter here for the intraday for like 100 200 point so let me show you now you can see according to the moving average price is still running in an uptrend and here we have seen price are running in an overbought zone and they are forming a uh, doji pattern right let me show you in a four hour chart how they are forming right in a four hour chart you can see almost similar uh, here you can see sometimes they are creating inverted hammer sometimes creating hammer pattern here you can see we have seen this is inverted hammer who people already sold they close their position again start buying and create a hammer pattern so in that case most of the people are start buying above this candle all right so before we enter in this market we must focus on small time frame right in a four hour also price is running in an uptrend let me show you in a daily time oh sorry one hour time frame this is called middle time frame so now you can see price is running in a range so in that case most of the terror uh, find out the trend or range of this market so let me connect most process point here and here you can see now price is running in this range here you can see all right this is a trading range right now here we can see so uh, most of the aggressive trader are uh, when price hit this uh, supporting line they are entering buy here uh, and when price will hit this upper uh, line so they are closing in this area so once they uh, hit this upper area so they are start selling and they are closing their position in this area so this is a range trading all right so 
In that case, if you want to enter for the buy or sell, you must follow this range. Alright, let me show you in a small time frame, 15 minutes, how it should look like that. Let me zoom a little more. Here, now you can see, this is 15 minutes. And a 15 minute chart, uh, almost the same, most of the people are entering here for the buy in this area and they are closing their position in this area. So if you want to trade uh, today for the intraday, so you just always try to go with the trend. So trend, uh, we have seen in all time frame like daily, 4 hour, H1 and 15 minute all are running in the up frame. So you must wait for buy only, right? So where is the buy opportunity? Let me show you. So we have seen a buy opportunity in this area. So once price hit this line, so this is a buy opportunity. So uh, here you, you can see there are there are our target and when price will retrace toward this area. So again, we have seen this is our buy opportunity. All right. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please like and subscribe and thanks for watching.